Uh, Scrubbles, thank you for two years. Happy anniversary. Youngstar, thanks for 56. Gamercore, thank you for 22. How strong is your PSU? Uh, 1,200 watts. I always buy a bigger PSU than I need. Because it never draws more than it needs. So why not? And it allows for future expansion. You recently bought a rail card. Bathroom elements 12. Is this the gents or... Wait, that's got ladies on it. Oh, there's a gents. But this doesn't need anything doing to it, strangely enough. Hmm. It's a massive waste of area. Look at this. Four sinks, six bathroom elements, and two trash cans. Okay. Um, I know what we'll do. Four sinks, right. Let's try them. Sorry, net well, what what's efficient? What's not from efficiency point of view, sorry? Yours feels safe with a two beefy PSU, one rated for a lot of usage running at half. Must be better than one running at almost capacity. Your PSU is just like how much power it can generate. It's not it won't ever feed more than the board demands. So you're not if you buy if you buy a thousand watt PSU and your board and everything else draws five hundred, you'll draw five hundred. If you put a 750 in there, it'll still draw 500. So you're not ever going to, like, waste energy as such. That comes down to how efficient the power supply is. Full stop. It's a soap thing, isn't it? I think some people think that if you get a bigger power supply, then it wastes more energy, and that's just not how it works. Like, all, all transformers, which is effectively what a PSU is, all transformers waste energy. The process of taking, like, your mains voltage, your mains, like, 240 volts, whatever it is, and transferring it into, like, 5 volt DC, there's wasted energy that happens. Usually comes off as heat and there's noise, but you'll waste energy doing that. But different PSUs have different efficiency ratings. However, having a, a higher capacity power supply doesn't lead to more waste. It's better to have more capacity, more overhead, because if you later on, like I did, take your 2080 Ti out and put a 3090 in there, and now I have to give it an extra power cord because it demands even more wattage. If I didn't have a big, big enough PSU, in order to upgrade my graphics card, I'd also have to upgrade my PSU. You don't want to be doing that. Um, Network, wh where are you getting that information from? A higher fixed overhead. Where are you getting that from? What's this overhead? It'll be less efficient at 800 than the 800. No, it won't. In fact, my 1200 runs silent when it does less than 70% of its draw. It doesn't even turn the fan on. It's that efficient. It basically idles. Because it's not having to work very hard. Again, you need to look at every PSU and look at its efficiency ratings. They won't matter. 
and like every one there'll be a curve if you want to look at it it'll plot zero watts to maximum and then along it it'll show you like efficiency ratings and it'll change there'll be a certain point where it's running at its peak efficiency Hand dryers, that's what I was going to put along here. We'll put the hand dryers down this end. And then for the people who don't like hand dryers or when the hand dryers are broken. Your laptop's PSU is a nice room heater. <laughs> they used to say that about Intel uh, AMD CPUs, but now it's actually the Intels that run hotter. How the tables have turned. 12 bathroom elements and two trash cans. Uh, this is the ladies. Cubicles, I guess. Um, bathroom... One, two. Actually, let's do these. One, two, three, four. I think we can get four in here. Let's try that. You left chocolate on top of your PSU once. Melted the whole bag of buttons. Well, <laughs> yeah, no surprise there, really. Did you eat the buttons, though? That's the real question. Did you throw them away? Or are you like, meh, melted buttons, I'll deal with it. toilets. Got scroll, thank 51. Mr. Whiteland, tier 3, 94 months. ABC. Easy as 1, 2, 3. Wasn't that a Michael Jackson, uh, Jackson 5 song? I'm sure it was Jackson 5. It was Mr. Whiteland's birthday earlier this week. I wish Whiteland a happy birthday. Ten thousand dollars. I'll take it. Trash cans. Um, little bathroom ones. Put them by the door on the way out. Probably makes sense. PSUs tends to be most efficient, running around fifty percent load. Yeah. So. With mine, mine's a 1200 watt, so if that was true for me, it would peak, it would peak efficiency would be about 600 watts. I reckon my board and everything else probably, I know my motherboard draws about 300 watts maximum. The CPU, that'll draw 200 and something. I reckon I'm drawing 600, maybe 700 watts. So I'm, I'm pretty much hitting the sweet spot. Is there a way to get rid of the hands of the bottom of the screen? No. <laughs> you can hold a tool. <laughs> but you can't really get rid of them unless you do that. Quite bad at 20% or less and lose a bit, but not as much as 75. 
I think the nearer you get to capacity, the less efficient they become. Guys, we're at 99% here. 99%. Wyland, have you updated your graphics card recently? Your graphics driver, sorry. <gasps> There's a person. There's a person. Walking down the street. A replacement. Oh, there we go. Let's see that, cheeky. Let's check this room. Items to pick one. Items to pick up here somewhere. Uh, is there a window leading into that washroom? Why? There is, but two things. One, it's quite high, and secondly, it's only where people are washing their hands. Loving your landlord's playthrough. Can't figure out why wheelbarrow turning is so slow. It doesn't do that for me. That's interesting. That's interesting. Hmm. Let me turn that on its head. I can't quite work out why you can do it so quickly. <laughs> Wait, that didn't pick anything up here, but it did pick things up here. Not anymore. You've updated your GP driver, anything special? Yes. So earlier earlier in the stream, Whiteland, my, my PC shut down completely. Twice. Killed the stream. And when I say shut down, I mean not like a Doom, 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 shut down. I mean, like a off shut down. That kind of PC literally just turned off kind of shut down. And it did it, and I've never seen it before, but it did it while streaming today. And I brought the stream back, and it did it again within about 20 minutes. And then I updated my graphics card driver because somebody in the chat said they'd had the same thing from NVIDIA drivers a couple of weeks ago. So I updated my NVIDIA drivers to the one they rolled out yesterday. And fingers crossed, it's not done it yet. Items to pick. Where are these items to pick, I wonder? There. There's one. That is cheeky, that is. You went back to AMD GPU. Interesting. Was you having a problem with the NVIDIA? Ninety nine percent guys. How do we get a hundred percent out of this one, eh? I'm pretty certain we did everything up here. with the boards on it and that room was he was just in I'll go downstairs and have a look so I thought up here was sawed out you mean this room oh this room oh there's wind oh yeah 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 the windows on the outside oh you remember I 
100%. Continue. Sell. Other than random blue screen of death and game crashes, NVIDIA card work fine. Interesting. Is that that woman? Uh, I've got a skip to sell, I think. I'm sure I've got a skip to sell somewhere. This is just ridiculous. I think we're done. Burger bun. No ramps, no wheelchairs. Dude, you can't even get on the platform. <laughs> no. Can't even talk to your neighbours, look. Hey. Not interact. <laughs> okay. Finish. So let's sell this junk we don't need. Sell that. Was that a decoration or was that furniture? Okay. Yes. Look at this. The fly through of our amazing station. It looks a lot better than when we took over it. Actually, I'm surprised I couldn't paint those carriages. I bet I could. These containers here. No, you're not allowed to clear the weeds from the track. It's a bit weird like that. One and a half hours. Not including a couple of restarts. <laughs> from game crashes. We unlock the flat car. No, you can't hire NPCs to work for you. Nope. It's not that kind of game. Oh, it's derailed. Because I couldn't get over here to flick that switch in time. Right, 10 points. Hmm. Do we get the airbrush for nine points or the grinder for seven or the screwdriver for nine? What do you think? We could also, oh no, we've already got that. Where did that goes white again? Well, that should stay green, surely. 
Or we could get this for eight points, whatever this is, stopwatch. Wait, does that just let you move faster? Does that, that let you run around quicker? What is that stopwatch telling me? Oh, green's your active tool. Oh, I see. Take the grinder because the sponge sound is terrible. What do you mean? You mean that? Sandpaper. <laughs> Don't know what you mean. Denzality, thank you for seven months. Martin Light 23, thank you for always putting the work into entertainers. Thank you for two years, Martin, almost. A racer with a year. Uh, in celebration of the fact that the school year is now over, here, yeah, have some of Jeff's money. <laughs> yeah, this is curious. I'm wondering if that lets us go around a bit quicker. It's got a stopwatch, which implies saving time. Seven for what? Seven for reload and eight for highlight lasting longer. Oh, is that what it is? Seven for reload. Oh, that lets you ping more quickly. And that lets the ping last longer. Right. We tend to, we did a lot of ratcheting in the last one. Might get the grinder. It's part of the ping tools. Logically, it should not affect the general game walking speed. Yeah, I was just going off the gift they'd given you where it looks like he's running around in super fast time. It was a bit misleading. There you go. We got the grinder. What have we done here? Done nine, I think. Done number nine. Come on up Discord. Oh, this is like a nighttime mission with a turntable. Uh, Captain, think the Arg Sim is not available. You can't play Shiv. Nothing in the back of the truck. In the city at night. Repair the locomotive is the task. There's a broken locomotive on platform three. Use the right tools to bring it back to working order. some new ones back because why not it's actually relatively clean in here that is a bizarre place for a bin like what why would you put that bar Hmm. 
what style would work in here? Some people place the bend, some moves are good ideas, place the bend in their path. Yeah, I kind of feel like just make it so it's visible and not too far away, but in the way of getting to the lockers is just like a dumb idea, I think. That's my take on it. It's very posh tickets off, isn't it? See, like, all these accessories, look. Books, fire extinguishers, all these little things. Lovely little black bin there. All this stuff, none of which you can buy. It's in the game, but you can't buy it. I don't get that. They've gone to the trouble of making all these assets and then saying, yeah, but you can't actually get them with your tablet and decorate the place with them. We've drawn them, we've made them, but you can't use them. Oh, oh, the classic 8E stop code. That's actually a real error. <laughs> uh, Yorkshire Posty, thank you for 27 months. If this is the first time you've seen this stop error screen, restart your... Uh, if this screen appears again, follow these steps. Check to make sure you have adequate disk space. If a driver is identified in the stop message, disable the driver or check with the manufacturer for driver updates. Try changing video adapters. What kind of advice is this? So let me get this straight. You take the average pleb in the street and you say to them, check if you've got adequate disk space. Okay, I can do that. If a driver is identified in the stop message, looks down. Stop message. Is this a driver? What's a driver? Disable the driver, how? Or check with the manufacturer. Like, hello, yeah, yeah. Is uh, <laughs> is that Asus? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I've got this uh, blue screen here. Just wondering if you've got um, an update for the driver. What driver? Uh, KL1 dot sys? What? <laughs> Just, well, maybe I should try changing my video adapter. Um... What's a video adapter? <laughs> it's just like the worst message. Check with the hardware vendor for any BIOS updates. Again, most people don't know what a BIOS is, don't know how to update it, and pretty much never update it. Disable BIOS memory options such as caching or shadowing. Give me a break. Give me a break. Where do you change that? If you need to use safe mode or remove... To remove or disable components, most users haven't got a clue how to get into safe mode. Restart your computer, press F8 to select advanced startup options, and then select safe mode. I think it's just like... Meep, meep. Did Dave Summit work? It's mad, isn't it? It's just absolutely mad. You've never updated a BIOS. See? And you're not alone. I think on my motherboard, I've updated the BIOS seven times, I think. <laughs> this is cool. You haven't got a clock to auto update it yet? You're not alone, dude, honestly. Like the office layout, but it's a bit dark. Well, this one, you know why? Because it has like one light in the middle of this gigantic office. Actually, it has more than one light 
But this one doesn't work and isn't repairable either. Interesting. And this one just doesn't have one. Hey, it does. Look. What's going on? Maybe there's a separate light switch. Spooky. Most bias updating is horrible. Um, it's actually really simple. The problem that arises is this, the BIOS settings. Like knowing how to keep your BIOS settings. Because some updates will actually not load previous BIOS settings. Some updates. And they're the worst ones. Because then you've got to rebuild your settings. Which if you didn't take a lot of screenshots... You could be in trouble. There's lots of food machine in here because this one's broken, I think. Cold beverage. Load optimized defaults done. <laughs> There's a lot to be said for that. Do you know what? I reckon most pe most people would benefit from that. Oh, great. Fancy. I'm wondering if I can get a cubicle just like this one. Oh, these are nasty. Get rid of that. No, I don't think he's on the list either. Let's have a look. Get soap dish thingy. Oh, hang on. Toilet cubicle part and a door. Let's try that. The style of these is like completely different. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> How am I supposed to make this work? Wait, they've. I swear they've used a different kind of separator, though. Is that a separator? It doesn't look like it. it doesn't have that extra piece on it. That's so weird. Put that over there a sec. So, strictly speaking, that should line up like that. Which then leaves the problem here. The only option is a cubicle door is this one. All of the rest of them are just like... Actual full-on cubicles. There you go. There's a bit of a gap in his door, but you know. What what we're gonna do? 
they somehow they used those parts that but they were able to clip them into place I just there's no way I can put this in the position that it needs to be which is basically like that they're just full on cheated over here was the hand dryer I'll do stupid bathroom Uh, benches and chairs and two decorations. Um, why does this need benches? Okay, we'll have two of them. Two of them. Oh, that's a bit bigger. Than I thought it was. Eek. Still, it looks it looks like it suits the environment, so I think we'll keep them. Doesn't look out of place, does it? So we'll have them. And that. Hey. Okay. <laughs> Can we go out that way? No. There's a broken hand dryer in the bathroom. Hang on, I did see that. Oh yeah. They're not the best lights in the world. They're okay, but... Are those like dark toilets or just badly lit ones, I wonder? Right. Bathroom elements. Or a toilet or a cathedral. <laughs> right, two hand dryers, a couple of soap dispensers, a couple of them. Nobody would put a light switch in a train station. Quite simply because somebody would turn the light off. On the way out, they'd just be like, see ya, lol. <laughs> so nobody'd ever do that. Nobody is madness. I'd be tempted. <laughs> okay. Lots of food machines in here. Don't know what we're going to put on, though. Two food machines in this room. Blimey. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll move these.
Uh, yeah, the men, there was a separate male bathroom. I can't remember if it had urinals in it. Though. Right, food machine, let's see. Let's see what we got. Decorations. Two of them. Yeah, I'll have a court board, why not? Couple of exit signs. Okay, I need to get rid of that. <laughs> Snowman, because why not? Because obviously people will walk over to him. We need to protect him. Like that. In case you didn't know, that's the exit. Exit's that way. Station's currently closed. <laughs> it's dark down here. Why is there no light? Okay. Done. Um, right, let's go downstairs then. Whee! How many platforms does this station go? Platform two, platform three. Where's platform one? Platform one this way. That's the main corridor cleaned. It needs extra stuff in it, but it looks good. Yeah, we saw we saw people in the game. Amazingly. Keep out. Let's get rid of that. Now we should have got the screwdriver. <laughs> okay, that's mostly done. So we can't go inside. Is this repair the locomotive? But when I ping it, 
Is a broken law optimized on platform three? Use the right tools to bring it back to working order. Is this platform three? Yes. Use the right tools, it says. There's one item for replacement somewhere, but I can't work out... Is it that one? That sounds nothing like a grinder. Just sounds like a drill. Like, if I take my drill out and press the button, it'll sound a bit like that. Although, arguably, mine won't. Hang on. <laughs> Mine doesn't. My impact driver certainly won't sound like that. <laughs> My old drill used to sound like this. Drill ASMR, can you imagine? I think there's such a thing as drill a ASMR. Hang on. Because in ASMR, they talk really quietly, don't they? Like, put your headphones, put your headphones on quiet, guys. Turn up the volume, because I'm going to whisper. I'm, and then do things like they, they get plastic like this, don't they? They'll talk like this, and then with a bit of plastic. And then they'll be like, but this is drill ASMR. <laughs> Different kind of thing, Drill AM at Smart. People are like, whoa! <laughs> oh boy. Is ASMR still a thing on Twitch? I remember when it was pretty popular. The, the, the current in thing now seems to be hot tub stream. Well, I remember ASMR used to be a thing. I hope you clip that. If you want it in the highlights, you need to clip that. <laughs> uh, did I see the beat builders perform? Uh, mm, yes, yes, I did actually. Yeah, I remember now. I saw that performance. Yeah, that was pretty good. Yeah, they were cool. They were like climbing up platforms like boom, boom with the drills and things. That was cool. Yeah, yeah, Connor. You probably sub to like five of them. This thing doesn't really make it that much quicker, if I'm honest. Just makes a different, less annoying noise. What do to do down here?
Hot tub drilling, yeah. All the water drains out. Oh, come on. Every I swear. I fix every piece and then I scan and there's like one more piece has appeared. A replacement, 22 of 20. There's one item for replacement somewhere. That one. Is that on the track or is it up there? So it won't find it up here. It must be on the track. Unless it's over there somewhere. There you go. For it. There's loads of replacements now. Actually, no, there's only one. 